everybody and welcome back to reclaim your health with doTERRA i am your host chris and i'm glad to have you along today uh, in case you've forgotten what i look like when i'm weighing my backpack and sucking in my gut there i am uh i am here basically to talk about doTERRA as a wellness company and talk about their wellness products um, I am a firm believer that people need to take an active leadership role when it comes to their own health, and doTERRA has helped me do that, and it's got the products that can help you do that. So I want to share. Uh, remember, we are talking about the different uh, layers of doTERRA's wellness pyramid as we go through this weekly series. This week, we are on movement and metabolism, and don't forget that the more time you spend on these lifestyle steps, the wider the base of your pyramid, the less time you're going to spend at the top with your healthcare providers and your informed self care, and uh, you're going to have a happier life when you're doing these things daily and you're doing these things a minimal amount of time. What happens if that gets unbalanced and we don't pay attention to those things? our wellness pyramid gets inverted and it crumbles down and all kinds of bad things. So stick with me on the wellness pyramid and not the unwellness pyramid. All right, metabolism and movement. Uh, these are two that go together. The more you move, the more you metabolize. So uh, this is really the next step up of that wellness pyramid. You will remember last week we talked about nutrition and digestion. As I digest some not terribly nutritious, but very delicious coffee, um, that nutrition is, is what you're putting into your body. You need to put healthy things into your body, things that your body can actually break up and use. So nutrition is getting the right things in your body. Digestion is being able to break those things up into usable pieces. We don't build muscle or connective tissue or cartilage out of uh, tacos or or you know cake we have to break up those complex carbohydrates those those proteins into amino acids and things like that that's digestion and then here metabolism is the process of distributing those useful compounds to the body and we're going to talk about that in in a little bit more depth here later on that metabolism also goes along with the movement and and You've been hearing this over and over and over again. I don't think I need to talk too long about movement or exercise um, as, as being beneficial. Uh, we've heard it since the days of Hippocrates, the father of modern healthcare, who said, eating alone will not keep a man well. He must also take exercise. Probably sounded really profound when he said it in whatever language he said, but that's pretty straightforward, diet and exercise. That's what my doctor's been telling me for years and years and years. I also have the uh, sitting is the new smoking. I still love that phrase. When I first heard it a few years ago during COVID, I thought, wow, that's really novel. I'm going to keep saying that. I've heard it so many times now. I'm almost getting tired of it, but it is true. Uh, a lot of people, not everybody, but a lot of people have been working from home and there's a lot more sitting going on and it's taking its toll on us. So movement and met metabolic health are going to be really important. Uh, I am going to spend a little bit more time talking about um, the sort of new field of, of, of metabolic research. And basically, it, there's more and more studies and kind of preclinical pre trials going on that are saying that uh, your metabolism and how that supports your body is really connected to uh, your health and your performance and of, of all of the systems and inside your body. So we're going to take a look at that and take a deep dive into some of the doTERRA products. Uh, not a very deep dive. Take a deep wade, shallow dive into that pond and take a look at some of these things that doTERRA has for movement and metabolism. So first thing I want to get out there is when I talk about movement, I'm talking about for most people exercise. And I realize there are people who have jobs where they're moving all the time, whether you work in a warehouse or you're a lumberjack or carpenter or you know, an artist or something like that, where you're, you're moving all the time. That's not necessarily exercise. Exercise for me is, is after a long day at, at the office where I've been sitting and all day, uh, I go to the gym and I actually move to be moving. 
Now, there's a lot of people out there who actually move for their job or move constantly. Um, hello, working mothers and fathers. Um, excuse me, full-time mothers and fathers. I'm sure you're moving all the time too. So movement and exercise, kind of the same thing. Um, and I'm going to talk about them interchangeably. I'm going to get a little sloppy there, but but think about them, whatever it pertains to you. If you're going to the gym after you're sitting all day, think about it as exercise. If you're a stay-at-home dad who's chasing after four kids and a dog, then movement is your is your life. So there we go. Like I said, I don't have to extol the benefits of exercise to everybody. We've been hearing this uh, and, and seeing the studies for a long time. Uh, exercise is related to stress management, um, improved mood, flexibility, weight loss, cardiovascular health. It makes you look good, muscle tone, bone strength, all those great benefits from exercising. So I'm not going to I'm not going to sit here and say it's good to exercise. I hope you know that by now. What is a little tougher is getting to the gym and getting back to the gym. And sometimes there's some muscle fatigue. Sometimes there's minor injuries. Sometimes there's just plain old delayed onset muscle soreness, DOMS, or, you know, ah, my biceps hurt because I did curls. So Dead Tire's got some products that can help with that. And these kind of things happen to everybody. The picture on the right there on the bottom, um, the, the, the guy in the pink who's applying the doTERRA blue stick, um, deep blue, which I'm going to talk about here in a sec. Uh, he is applying that to Rory McIlroy. And you may have heard that name. He is the number two golfer in the world right now, quite an athlete at the top of his game. Even he gets dinged up and bruised up a little bit. He's got some back soreness. This was actually during the uh, FedEx Players Championship. So this is in the middle of his game, in the middle of his sport. And he's like, all right, I'm going to take care of some muscle soreness and gets his caddy to put some deep blue stick on him to, uh, to get some relief from the soreness he's feeling back there. So it's not just you who's sore. It's not just, you know, pro athletes don't have it easy. It's everybody. So you're not alone in that fight. So doTERRA has some things that can help us. Um, uh, the, the top pictures up there in the slide, uh, the dark blue stuff is actually uh, a product line, um, different forms of uh, something they call deep blue. And deep blue is a combination of plant extracts uh, that include wintergreen, chamomile, peppermint, osmanthus, and a few others in there. But really what it's designed to do is, is soothe um, aches and pains. Um, the 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 deep blue stick the one in the middle right there is a little bit unique from the others the others have the oil in it and it's whether it's either the the straight oil or it's a uh, a capsule that's got the the extracts in it or it's like a lotion but this one in the middle is is kind of like um it's a stick it's a it's it's a rub on stick kind of like a deodorant stick and uh, it's got also copaiba, and that's something the other four don't. But the copaiba is really useful in promoting the body's homeostasis, helping the body's systems that repair itself do their job better. So that copaiba is really supportive of the body taking care of itself. So not only does the deep blue stick have that in it, along with the deep blue extracts, but it's also got menthol in it, and that allows it to be actually labeled and tested by the FDA to uh, uh, work as a pain reliever. So it's for temporary le relief of minor aches and pains in muscles and joints uh, uh, da, 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 associated with backache, strains, bruises, arthritis, and sprains. So actually this one is labeled for um, uh, a particular medical condition, um, but the others are going to support that as well. So uh, those deep blue products really are for when you're not feeling like going to the gym or when you're sore and you still need to work out and you need to get over that hump or when just mobility is a little bit tougher. My parents uh, are in their 70s and still gardening and, and making a new deck on the back of their house and and they put this on their knees uh, and elbows and the occasional hip, uh, sore joints and things like that. So 
uh, even though they're not really into the natural wellness products and the doTERRA and all that stuff, I give them a few deep blue sticks and they keep asking for more. So great for athletes, great for everyday movement, um, help soothe and, 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 and ease those joint aches and pains and muscle strains. Now, the other products kind of on the top there, those are, are sort of specific things that, that I use um, for getting to the gym and getting back to the gym. The, the little blue, the light blue one there towards the middle is something called Breathe Stick. And doTERRA has got a blend of, of uh, plant extracts called Breathe, and it's things like eucalyptus and peppermint and a couple other in there. But what it really does is it opens up that respiratory system, it clears out the sinuses, it, it 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 clears out the bronchi and all that kind of thing, and it and it and it helps you get more oxygen into your body, um, just by physically opening up that whole system. And it's got a nice, clean, fresh smell. I use it as a pre-workout kind of thing. I'll rub some on my chest, take a sniff of it, and it's it's got a motivating smell, and um, that that vapor and then the absorption through my skin of that that stick it's kind of like the deep blue stick that actually opens up my chest and it helps me breathe and it makes for better workouts for me i really like it a lot um so those are two that i have in the gym bag my sticks i love my sticks because they're easy to use i can put some of this on a sore neck and still eat nachos and not have it all over my fingers um same thing with the breeze stick now, one of the other things that, that doTERRA really supports in my life is, is when I get those minor issues, uh, getting back into the gym faster or doing these things uh, a little bit faster. And lemongrass is one that I have up there that's commonly uh, recommended for supporting um, uh, ligaments and joints and tendons. Uh, if you have a little strain, a pull, a little bit of pain in there. This is one that will help uh, uh, repair. Well, I don't know if I can say help repair, but this is one that good that, that supports the body's processes that help repair that. Um, I know in my own personal life, I'm I'm healing a little bit faster on those minor aches and sprains uh, with the lemongrass. And then same thing with the copaiba. The copaiba really is is one of those things that in, that interacts with your endocannabinoid system. And it, uh, it helps the body's homeostasis. So it supports the body's processes that take care of itself. So you're, you're really giving the healers um, support to heal the rest of the body. And then finally, if you're just having trouble getting to the gym, they, they do make a product called Motivate. It's a little roll-on ball. It smells great. It kind of motivates. I use it more in the office, but I figured if you need extra motivation, hey, there's actually something called Motivate. But um, these are all great for uh, getting you into the gym, getting you back into the gym, getting you back into the gym faster, those kinds of things. There's no magic pill or no magic cream you can rub on your tummy that, that's going to make you healthy and fit. Kind of have to do it yourself. But these things, I, 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 I've, I've experienced, these things have helped me. Okay. Like I said, I'm not going to talk at nauseum about exercise. Uh, I hope you know that it's good for you. Uh, what I do want to talk a little bit more in depth about is metabolic health. And kind of a new term, not everybody's heard it. It's It was new to me when it was introduced to me maybe six months, a year ago, somewhere in there. So, so what is metabolic health? Let's go ahead and define that. So good metabolic health is um, your body digesting and, and absorbing nutrients uh, at a sustainable, constant, uh, a regular rate. So at stable levels of blood sugar, blood fat, and insulin, even after you're eating food or towards the end of the day when things kind of taper off, if you've got good metabolic health, those, those blood sugar levels, the fat levels, and the insulin levels are going to try and stay a little bit steadier. So the opposite would be blood sugar spikes and carb spikes and and crashes you know you have the big pasta meal and you're like oh lunch was great and then you know 30 minutes later you're asleep because you have no more energy or you get the sugar high and then the sugar crash and your body starts to shake and it's like, am i pre-diabetic oh no you know so that's bad metabolic health good metabolic health 
is having the delivery at stable levels. So uh, is this something you need to worry about? Yeah, probably. Only about 7% of Americans, adult population, uh, have optimal cardiometabolic health. So 7% of you, I'm probably not optimal. I'm working towards there. I'm, I'm taking my supplements. I'm going to the gym. I'm doing those things. Am I in that 7%? Chances are not. So this is something that we need to work on. And why do we need to work on this? Um, the more studies that are coming out in this new area are showing us that our metabolic health and our biological age are inseparable. So normally I don't read directly from a slide, but that's an important one. What does that mean? So when we talk about our metabolic health, we talk about our body's ability to, you know, get all of these things into the system, the delivery system. Remember the, the nutrition is getting the right things into the body. The digestion is breaking them up into usable parts. And then the, the metabolism is being able to distribute that and use it throughout the body. So if you have a distribution center that's, that's doing um, sugar, blood sugar spikes, it's trying to ram a bunch of blood sugar all through your body all at once. And your body's trying to use that, go, ah, you get a blood sugar spike. Or if you don't have enough, you get a blood sugar crash and your body doesn't have enough to, uh, to use. And then you're just like, uh, you feel terrible. So that metabolic health is being able to consistently do that with blood sugars, insulin, blood fats, and things like that. So your metabolic health and your biological age are inseparable. The biological age we're talking about is not your chronological age, but your biological age. So how well your body works, how well the biology inside your body, the joints are working, the tendons are flexible, the, 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 the fascia inside is slipping against each other the way that it should, how well your body works, not necessarily your chronological age. Okay. You can, you can, you can play around with your chronological age. You can be 60, 70 years old and still out there, uh, uh, chopping wood, building a new deck and gardening like my parents are. So metabolic health and biological age are inseparable. Now, another way to show that is graphic. Me being an engineer, I love graphs. So <laughs> let's look at a little graph here. Uh, on the x-axis, on the uh, horizontal x-axis, we have your lifespan. That is that is the number of years that you live. That is your chronological age. That's I am currently 48 years old, so I would be at 48 on that lifespan. Okay, your health span is how healthy you are, and that's the vertical axis. And we're not going to put numbers on it. I'm going to, I'm, you know, I'm 74 health units. There's nothing like that, but. But the taller you are on that X or excuse me, Y axis is your health span. So if we plot those against each other and we look at a typical American um, and we're starting late teens, early 20s, when you're mature, after you've gone through puberty and, and then those kinds of things, you're really healthy. I mean, you're at the top of your game. You're really where you're supposed to be. Uh, uh, ev evolutionarily, this is your, 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 your sweet spot. So you've got a pretty good health span. You're all the way towards the top and you can go along there pretty well for a while. And then it starts to fall off. And over time, you know, if you, if you just keep doing what you're doing, it falls off at a pretty regular rate. And then at some arbitrary point here, um, we're going to say you're old. And it could be whatever level you want to choose where it's like, I can't do the things that I want to do, or my quality of life has changed permanently and I can't, can't run anymore. Uh, you know, I, at, at some point you reach that, that level or that thing where you say, okay, I'm old. I'm not doing the things that I could do. All right. And then after that point, um, Pretty much you go downhill. There's no nice way to say it. Your your health span goes to zero and your lifespan pretty much stops. So that's kind of your death. I'm sorry. I uh, hate to be morbid, but that's what we're looking at. A typical American, you know, once you're mature, you kind of start out there. And then as you get older, things kind of wear out. Things get uh, Things get old and then things die.
It's just a part of life. Now, if you're trying to take care of this and you're using a lot of Western medicine and you're trying to look at your blood sugar numbers and you're taking medication for your cholesterol and stuff like that, you can add a little bit of, of, of health span to those years. You can, you can sort of push that curve out to, uh, out to the right a little bit. And, and, and down there towards the end of your lifespan, um, there's some heroic measures that can be taken. You know, if you have a heart attack, they can, they can, they can bring you back from a heart attack. There's transplant things. So your overall number of years you live is, is going to be significantly longer. But look at the difference between, you know, the the quality of life in there. Uh, you're not getting that much of a boost in years before you, you have that arbitrary point where you start to feel old or you decide, decide you're old. So that's kind of a typical American taking care of themselves. Now, what doTERRA has done with this, uh, what doTERRA has done is they've introduced a, a system called the, the MetaPower system. And it's a couple of supplements and some collagen. And what they really tried to do is target this metabolic health and improve this metabolic health. And what they're, they're, they're doing is extending that health span more years into your lifespan. So their, their tagline, I think, is uh, it's not the number of years you live. It's the number of, of years... No, it's not the number of years that you live healthy. It's the health in the years you, I don't know what their tagline is. I'm much better with graphs, but basically what they're saying is if you have meta better metabolic health, things are going to biologically work longer. So you get this extended period of years where your health span is, is where your, where your lifespan is healthier. Okay, so that's what they're targeting with the the metabolic support. So what is this mysterious meta power system? Well, it's actually three things. Um, it's two supplements and some collagen there. They've got like six different products down at the bottom. But the four on the right all contain the same um, same plant extracts. They're just different delivery systems. And, and it's something called the MetaPower, uh, let me get the right name, the MetaPower Metabolic Blend. And don't forget, you can go out to doTERRA.com. You can check out these products and go to the link that is their product information page and print this out. It'll give you a picture of the product. It'll give you what's in it. It'll give you uses. It'll give you what it's targeted for, all kinds of things. Um, this is my one pager that I go to to be like, what is it? How do I use it? Are there any things I need to be worried about? Um, why is it good? Okay. And the why is it good up there? But basically, those four products on the right are all have this uh, MetaPower Metabolic Blend in it. And you can uh, get that in just the straight oil on the right. You can get it in uh, sort of a, a, a gel cap um, in the large bottle. Uh, you can also get it through gum or or something called beadlets. Beadlets are like tiny little gel caps about the size of a bead. But these are all containing the four different delivery methods of the same that same uh, MetaPower metabolic blend. And what that really targets is um, your appetite. Uh, it's got some things in there that can affect your appetite uh, and help curb cravings and things like that. And it also um, helps uh, against uh, fat cell maturation. We'll talk about that one in a sec. But the other two products are uh, sort of the smaller bottle here is this is another another capsule and this one is called MetaPower Assist. Um, and what that is, is it's a number of extracts, including the big one I want to talk about, which is mulberry extract. And mulberry extract has been shown to um, reduce the absorption of carbohydrates. And there's some, some nervy processes that go on in the background where the mulberry extract interacts with enzymes that break up the carbohydrates that help you to uh, absorb those and it slows down the process making it more regular but we're not going to get that deep into it today but basically that mulberry extract is going to help keep a consistent um blood sugar level okay it's not going to completely take care of the spikes but it will ease the tops and it'll it'll keep the bottoms from from going too deep so it it it, it, it cuts the spikes down to humps 
let's go ahead and say. So that's the second one. And then the third one is uh, uh, collagen. And they have the box there. And uh, that box basically is just a bunch of packets of collagen. I'll open it up here. It looks like this one. And we've got a bunch of different packet or a bunch of the same packet at collagen. There's a, there's a month's supply in that box, but basically this is just powder inside. And uh, I think that's right side up. Nope, that's right side up. Meta power advantage is what this is called. And um, there's a lot of collagen that's available on the market. Uh, this is different and I'll tell you why in a minute, but this is the third part of that meta power system. Okay. So if we look at them individually, uh, that MetaPower metabolic blend, the vertical one I talked to, which the four different delivery systems, I like the gel caps because they're easy, um, but it's got some stuff in it. It's got grapefruit and lemon and peppermint, ginger and cinnamon mark. And, and all those are super tasty on their own. Um, but this is intended to be taken internally and it helps with a few things. Number one is it curbs those cravings. The lemon and the grapefruit and ginger are really good for that. So is the peppermint. And then the uh, sporting and metabolic health, the cinnamon bark does a lot of, of, of support in keeping that blood sugar regular level. Uh, and then they're all in, uh, this blend has been shown in some, some preclinical trials. Uh, this blend has been has been shown to inhibit fat cell maturation. And again, if you want to go a little deeper into this, go check out doTERRA's webpage and look at their MetaPower system, take a class, read their blogs, anything like that. Um, but basically, the life cycle of your fat cells, they start out small, and as they mature, they get bigger and bigger. And what this does is it keeps those fat cells small. So it's, it's, it's really targeted at, at uh, not letting those fat cells get bigger and bigger. And it's not necessarily about the number of fat cells you have. It's also about the size of the ones you have. So if you have all mature fat cells, they're all going to be as big as they, are, they can. But if you're inhibiting that maturation process, then uh, a proportion of them are going to be, you know, at that small immature phase. And, and that's going to reduce bulk on your body. Okay. So that's that metabolic thing. Um, I like the capsules. Some people like the gum. Uh, some people like the beadlets. However you want it. That's that's the metabolic one. That's the first part. The second part is this metabolic assist. And so here's your blend. And here's an assist. Like I said, it's got that, that mulberry extract, which really reduces um, those glucose spikes, those blood sugar spikes. And how it does that is some chemistry, some biochemistry in there where it ties up another thing that usually helps in the absorption of those carbs. And it really just stabilizes that blood sugar. Um, I know from personal experience that when I'm taking this, I have quite a bit fewer blood sugar crashes during the day. Uh, typically I'll have a large lunch and then in the afternoon, two, three, four o'clock, somewhere in there, my blood sugar would tend to crash. Um, and it was, it was, it was not a good feeling. I would get sweaty and kind of shaky and things like that. Since I've been taking that, this is those, those blood sugar crashes have really reduced and, and in numbers, I'll say it was probably happening or more times a month you know when i would have that feeling and i'd have to go find some apple juice or something to get that blood sugar back up um but since i've been taking this it's been cut down to where it's really rare like maybe once every three months and that is a significant difference that i've noticed almost almost immediately within the first month of taking this stuff and it's like wow something's happening but that MedPower Assist has really been a game changer for me. Okay. And then the third thing is, of course, the collagen. Um, this collagen is different than the collagens that are out there. Uh, uh, and, and I'll show you what's in it in a second. But uh, a lot of the collagens out there 
um, might have multiple types of collagen. There's, there's some I've seen with three or five different kinds. This one has nine different types of collagen in it. And it's also got some other ingredients that are going to improve cognitive function um, and improve uh, uh, your biological aging and improve your health span. And let's take a look at the next page to look what's in it. So there's a lot of marine collagen. And this is collagen that's really good for the inside of the body. There's collagen that's good for hair and nails and, and, and um, skin and things like that. This is good for those, but it's also really good for joints and connective tissues and, and just general mobility and elasticity. It helps the fascia in your body, this collagen. Collagen is the most, pro, the most uh, uh, abundant protein in your body, by the way. So this is uh, collagen for the inside. It's also got collagen for the outside um, in the hyaluronic acid. Um, it's got a number of um, other useful things like the vitamin C and the biotin and the rose fruit extract and things like that. But this also has something in it, um, these three compounds, the nicotinamide mononucleotide, and then the nicotinamide adenosine dinucleotide H. Uh, so that's that molecule bound to a proton. And then this, resver this resveratrol. That's always hard for me to say. The resveratrol. So all of those are, are um, known to uh, support the production of NAD plus in the body. Um, and what that is, is that NAD plus actually works inside the cell. It works in the mitochondria, the powerhouse of the cell, as we know from internet means. Uh, the mitochondria of the cell to help turn food energy into uh, chemical energy in your body. So, so getting a little bit nerdy here, uh, that NADH and the NMN and that resveratrol are going to help the process that promotes adenosine diphosphate into adenosine triphosphate, ADP into ATP. And that breakdown of ATP is where we directly get the energy in our body. So this has got sort of the precursors for that energy in our body. And, and, and this is definitely good for um, um, keeping those levels healthy. Those are part of the things in the metabolic health that tend to trail off as we get chronologically older. So a little bit of supplement isn't going to hurt you, though. Okay. So um, those are the three products in the metabolic system, the metabolic power metabolic support system. So the two supplements and the collagen these were really intended to be uh, taken with the doTERRA uh, lifelong vitality. Um, so really, if you're working on this second rung of the wellness pyramid, uh, it, it kind of assumes that you're working on the first rung too. So it's not entirely necessary if you're eating a, a great diet of, of natural and wild, uh, colorful fruits and vegetables, as well as uh, healthy levels of protein and all those things. You might not need the nutrient support, but for most Americans, yeah, we need the nutrient support. So doTERRA really developed this whole system to be taken in conjunction with that lifelong vitality and making sure that you have um, a good nutrition support. Okay. So what does a typical daily schedule look like? Uh, you could take a look at this um, and, and sort of read through it. This is talking about all the different ways to take it. This, this schedule sort of says, take the collagen, take the, take the, uh, the blend in the pill form and the liquid form and the gum and the beadlets. Uh, what I typically do is when I get up in the morning, I have two of these because I'm a big guy and probably need a little bit more help. Um, but I'm taking two of these with water and actually it doesn't taste too bad. It's kind of citrusy, kind of orange, not too sweet, not too tart. Um, mix it with cold water, shake it up about eight ounces for two packs of this. Um, I like it a little thick, I guess. But drink that down and, and yeah, not something you have to choke down. But I take two of these in the morning and then uh, one of the MetaPower soft gels in the morning. So that's my morning. Lunchtime rolls around. Um, with lunch, I take another one of these, and then I take one of these for the blood sugar. And I have that with lunch. And then dinner time rolls around. 
same thing. So I'm taking three of these a day, two of these a day, and then two of these in the morning. And that's that's what's been working for me. As I get healthier, uh, and maybe drop a little bit of extra uh, uh, mature fat cells, we'll say, that may change. Um, I may go down to one package of collagen, or I may decide that uh, I want less of this or more of this. And same thing, I may I may turn into uh, somebody that's that's taking beadlets to help with cravings or things like that. But there's there's a lot of different ways to do it. If you check out DoTerra, there are actually different plans for like, let's say you're an athlete and you do all these things. This is like a suggested kind of thing. But let's say you're a couch potato like Chris and, you know, sucks his gut in when he's taking pictures. Maybe you look at this kind of plan. So check out the DoTerra website for this. But uh, this this metabolic um, system, the DoTerra MetaPower has been really useful in my life. And I, I, I've noticed the difference with, with all three of these products. So uh, what do you do if you want to learn more? Uh, pretty simple. Uh, you can join me uh, Sunday nights, at seven o'clock central time. I'm usually live. This week was a bit of a uh, uh, scheduling mishap. Um, but you can check out the videos live. You can check them out as they're posted on Julie Scott's uh, YouTube page. It's Julie Scott Body Sound. Uh, and we'll be talking about the wellness pyramid and the different levels in that uh, one a week for a while. And then we'll probably go back and recap. But if you have questions, uh, check out the video and, and shoot me a comment or get a hold of me directly. The other thing you can do is, is check out doTERRA. Um, doTERRA.com has got a lot of free information. You don't even have to log in to get it. I mean, right there, you can go to the product, you can print out these product information pages. They do offer a lot of free classes. Like if you want to learn more about what this metapower system is, you want to learn more about the nerdy things from actual scientists who can pronounce all the names of these things. Uh, they have people doing uh, video classes. Do at your own pace that you can do. Um, they also have downloads for like uh, quick reference guides and, you know, uh, different things like that, where you can just get more into the science behind it. Of course, they've got articles and blogs. Um, one thing I don't have on here, but I always encourage people, go to outside sources, whatever source you trust. Uh, look for things like NMN, NAD+, metabolic health, um, all those kinds of things. doTERRA isn't the only company doing research on these. Um, doTERRA is the company that that I really trust and I believe I've had success with a lot of their products that I have tried. Um, pretty much all of their products that I've I've tried. I haven't tried them all, of course. Um, but I I really do believe the science that they're putting out there. I believe that they're doing the right things uh, to make the world a better place. And I believe in the efficacy of their products. So do check doTERRA, do check elsewhere. And then finally, if you want a little bit more hands-on <clears throat> experience with doTERRA, uh, right now they are doing uh, uh, sort of a reclaim your health tour across the United States. And basically what's going on is there are events in different cities. Uh, uh, there's probably a couple hundred of them going on in the United States if they haven't already passed, actually. It's right in the middle of it. But you can get hands-on with a lot of these products, including the MetaPower system um, from uh, at these events. And you can talk to people who uh, are using these products and they usually have some representatives from doTERRA corporate there. So you can actually talk to the people who, who, who have developed these or who've worked with them or work hand in hand with the people who've made them and say, okay, you know, what is the intent here? You can get deep into questions like, well, I have a condition where I'm doing this and this, you know, is this going to interfere? And, and so you can get more hands-on and ask in-depth and questions for those too. So check out their vanity link at tour.doterra.com and that'll take you to like a registration page and you can see where it's happening in your area. Uh, I live in Illinois, for example, and there's like four different cities around Illinois um, that it's happening. So take a look at any of those sources. Come back, check me out, check the videos out on YouTube, go to doterra and outside sources, and then check out that tour.doterra.com. So. We hope to see you next week. Uh, we are going to be talking about the next level of the wellness pyramid. Can you tell me what it is?
I can't remember off the top of my head, but I do believe it is uh, reducing stress and uh, stress management and yes, stress management and rest. Two of my favorite things. I'm going to love talking to you about this because doTERRA has got some great sleep products. So until next time, thank you, everyone. How do you stop this thing?